and doing your chin-up weighs 554.4 newtons. Disregarding the weight of the arms, during the first 25 centimeters of the lift, each arm exerts an upward force of 407 newtons on the torso. The acceleration of gravity is 9.81 meters per second squared. If the upper movement starts from rest, what is the person's speed at this point? Answer should be in meters per second. So, our diagram is that our box is our person, and the arrow downward is his weight, which is 554.4 newtons. He also has two arms giving an upward force of 407 newtons. So, in order to find his net force upwards, we have to times or multiply 407 times 2, and we get 814 newtons. And then minus his downward force of 554.4 newtons gives us our net force of 259.6 newtons. The acceleration of gravity is 9.81 meters per second. And our equation is work, which is for net force times distance, equals kinetic energy, which is 1 half m over v squared. And in order for this problem to work, we have to do two things, which is convert 25 centimeters to 0.25 millimeters, I mean 0.25 meters, and we have to um, find his weight, which is, I mean his mass, which is force of gravity, the force newtons divided by gravity, which is 56.51 kilograms. So we plug in, we use our equation of net force times distance equals one half m over v squared, and we plug in all our numbers. So we have 259.6, which is our net force, times 0.25 meters, which is our distance. Then we have the kinetic energy formula, which is one half mass, which is 56.51 kilograms times V squared. 259.6 times 0.25 meters is 64.9, and one half, 56, one half of 56.51 is 28.255 times v squared. We divide 64.9 by 28.25 and we get 2.2969 velocity squared. We take the square root of our velocity and our 2.2969 and we get Velocity equals 1.5155 meters per second.